Indeed. something. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Well, here we are uh, heading into the weekend, heading into April, and last <laughs> weekend was kind of a washout. So. Yeah, we've got those April showers early, so maybe we can turn them off here. Yeah, we turn things around. Yeah, rain comes to an end later on tonight, especially, and that means some sunshine for both Saturday and Sunday and some higher temperatures to boot. Right now, it's still chilly out there, nowhere near 50 degrees, unfortunately. We're still in the upper 30s and low 40s, but that rain continues to, to diminish. Now, it's happening slowly, so it's still pretty damp out there. And the leftover raindrops we have at this hour, moving across Harsons Island, Clay Township, southern portions of St. Clair County, across Lake St. Clair, into portions of Macomb County as well, including St. Clair Shores. Down Downtown Detroit getting some leftover raindrops also, but those will be fewer and more far between as we go into later on this evening. Drier weather off to our west. Still a couple more raindrops will be around before midnight, but drier conditions and the clouds start to break apart, especially by tomorrow afternoon. Today, only 43 for a high, 10 degrees lower than average, but will be more seasonable once that sunshine reappears for this weekend. In fact, warmer than average by Sunday. 43 degrees right now, but visibility has improved. Now it's up to nine miles since you joined us earlier at 4 p.m. Metro zone for tonight. Temperatures stay away from the freezing mark. That is some great news. Even though it will be damp and slippery because of wet roadways, they won't become frozen, folks. Temperatures anywhere from 37 to 39 degrees in the metro zone. In your four zone weather south of I-94, 37 to 39 as well from Luna Pier over into places like Tecumseh. West of 275 in our west zone, we're looking at Novi at 36 overnight. Chilly also in portions of Livingston County, so make sure the pets are back indoors. 35 for our friends in Yale, low and middle 40s staying above freezing in our north zone, north of Hall Road. In fact, it's 37 degrees right now in Sandusky. I think temperatures pretty much stay there or go down just a few more degrees overnight tonight. But high pressure is on the way to rescue us from this rain and mess that we're seeing right now. The storm system responsible for it continues to move off to the east. It means snow for New England, including Boston. That's going to be something. But around here, much calmer weather for at least Saturday and Sunday before more showers start to return by next week. So don't put it on the umbrellas just yet. We're looking at 35 degrees, cloudy, chilly, and still damp as we go through this evening. For any sort of activities that you have, you have events going on at the Wright Museum. You got the comedy, the Night of Laughs happening over at Joe Lewis Arena. It's going to be a good night for tonight with drier conditions eventually, but 35 overnight. Big Sean also in town playing over at the Fox, headlining over there. 52 for a high tomorrow with partly sunny skies. That's right. We're going to see the sun again by the end of tomorrow. Also, when you join me on Sunday on Local 4 News today in the morning and also in the afternoon. We're looking at 59 degrees with sunnier skies to round out our weekend. But then get ready for that rain returning. Spring showers return for the first full week of April from Monday even through Thursday. There'll be some dry instances here and there, but still some wet conditions, especially on Monday and the middle of next week. Home opener, though, happening That's on right. Friday. Looking at dry weather. Might be chilly at the ballpark, but looking dry next Friday. Always chilly for yep. the opener. All right.